Hello everyone and welcome back. This video is going to be about your other assignment for this week. You're going to be creating a movie database, quote unquote. Not really, you're just going to be using arrays and objects to store some data. Not a true database, but you'll get the idea. What you are going to do is you are going to create an array of movies that you have or have not seen. And if you've seen them, you're going to give them a star rating. If you have not seen them, that's fine, that's not a problem. And then, after you've created this data, you're going to use some logic to print it out differently based on whether you've seen it or not. I would like you to make a const movies, which is an array, and inside of here, put several objects. On these objects, you're going to put the title, whatever the title is. You are going to put the um, star, has seen or not, has seen, true or false, and then stars, one to five. And you're going to do this with several of them. And I would suggest you simply copy and paste. And then update this with, with real movies that you've seen, that whether you like it or not, so on and so forth. Put in a couple that you haven't seen. And then at the bottom, you are going to use some logic to loop through them and print to the console information based on whether you've seen it or not. And if you have, how many stars you gave it. So, this is an example. You've not seen, I've not seen Casablanca, and I know I'm a terrible person, but I have never seen it. You have seen The Boondock Saints and gave it four stars. This is a lie. I actually gave it five because it's fantastic. I have seen Zootopia and gave it 4.5. I love Zootopia. It's a great movie. So this is what you're going to end up doing. So you, whatever logic you want, I highly suggest you use a for each, but that's entirely up to you. That's all you got to do. Create some data. Data needs to be structured like this. And then at the bottom, print it out to the console. Make sure that if you're using a function, you call your function. As always, if you have any questions, let me know and I'll be happy to help. Thanks.